Ladies and gentlemen, let me just welcome you to this swearing-in ceremony. Of course, I will, as Cabinet Secretary, be uh, swearing in the new Attorney General as um, delegated by the um, Governor General, and of course, consistent with a precedent that has been established, um, given that the Attorney General is being appointed as a public officer. Um, so I will first um, hand to you your warrant of appointment. Thank you. And um, we will then administer uh, the requisite rules. Assisting us, of course, in the activity this afternoon is the EDC to the Governor General. So, first with the oath of allegiance. I, Leslie Vincent Mondesi, do swear that I will, I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to St. Lucia, that I will uphold and defend the Constitution and the laws of St. Lucia, and that I will conscientiously and impartially discharge my responsibilities to the people of St. Lucia. So help me God. I, Leslie Vincent Mondesi, do swear that I will faithfully bear true allegiance to St. Lucia, that I will discharge my duties and perform my functions honestly, to the best of my ability, faithfully in accordance with the law, and always in the interest of the sovereignty, integrity, solidarity, well-being, and prosperity of St. Lucia, and that I will not directly or indirectly communicate or reveal the business or proceedings of the cabinet or the nature or contents of any document communicated to me or any matter coming to my knowledge in my capacity as the Attorney General, except as may be required for the due discharge of my duties. So help me God. Congratulations, Honorable Attorney General. Thank you very much. And welcome to your duties. Thank you very much. Sir. Thank you. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Um, first and foremost, I wish to, I will start by thanking the Almighty God for blessing me with the opportunity to be here on this beautiful day. It is indeed with great sense of honor that I stand before you all to accept the position of Attorney General of our beautiful country, St. Lucia. I would like to thank the Honorable Prime Minister for having the confidence in me and for trusting my ability to carry out this task at such a crucial time of our history. My gratitude also goes to my family, my friends and my colleagues for all the support that I have received and thus far received thus far and the encouragement over the years. Special mention to my brother colleague, Brother Claudius Francis, who is here with us today. I think we did it, my brother. We did it. At this point, I want to pay a special tribute to my now deceased aunts who raised me and who, without a doubt, would have been very proud of me today. I pledge to do my utmost best in performing the task which has been entrusted to me. I will not pretend that it's an easy endeavor, and obviously it will take a lot of hard work, but I am up for the challenge, and I'm ready to serve my people and my country with devotion and pride. Thank you very much this afternoon. Thank you. Welcome again, Attorney General, to your talk. Thank you very much. 